Hello, Stephanie here with True Door Property Management. Today we will discuss whether landlords should opt for a two-year lease as opposed to the standard one-year lease. But first, let's discuss the advantages of entering into a two-year lease agreement. Stability and predictability are some of the pros. When you commit to a two-year lease, your tenant is locked in for a longer period of time and you decrease your turnover risk. Now, let's talk about the disadvantages of a two-year lease. Because the rental price is set in for a two-year lease, you will not be able to raise raise rent until a two-year lease expires. The next problem, a two-year lease lacks flexibility. If you want to sell your property, this would make it difficult to sell with a tenant in place. If for some reason you don't like your tenant, maybe they're smoking, maybe they're hoarders, or maybe they're fighting with the neighbors. If you have any problems you're, with your tenant, you can't remove them for two years. Most landlords want flexibility more than they want stability because flexibility gives the landlords more power. Here at True Door Property Management, we advise our clients to stick to a one-year lease, mainly to stay on top of market rents annually, and also provide the owner with some additional flexibility after the lease term is over. Thanks for joining me today as we explore the pros and cons of a two-year lease. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and until next time. With True Door Property Management, making you more money with less drama.